Okay, so here we have butterfly, uh, butterfly milkweed, something like orange milkweed, Escapelius tuberosa. Uh, again, milkweeds, of course, are valuable for monarchs, as people may well know. It's one of the things that uh, they one of one of the native host plants. This is one of the short, uh, one of the short milkweeds. It can really take dry conditions. Not always easy to establish because again, tuberosa has a big root to it that was used in all sorts of medicines and so forth. But when it when it is planted, it does take. It's pretty good. It can take if you mow it at the right time. It can take some mowing. And again, the the flowers are of course attractive to all sorts of things, most especially butterflies. And of course, as we mentioned. The, um, it, it is a milkweed, so this is what monarchs need in order to uh, in order to produce any more monarchs. Now, it is probably the least of the, the least toxic of all of the milkweeds, and because of that, it's not the preferred choice. Uh, they prefer common milkweed and some of the other milkweeds more than this, but it is one that they will use. Even though, again, um, if you were to pull this off, it does not have a lot of milky uh, cardioglycosate in there to protect the plant. But anyways, orange milkweed, butterfly weed. One of the neat, Asclepius uh, tuberosus, one of the neat, uh, low-growing, heat-tolerant um, milkweeds that we have here in Northern Virginia.